I'm going to show you seven little known side hustles that can make you as much as $300 per day. With the last few on this list making you more than $100,000 per year, depending on how far you take them. Side hustles like these help change my life and they can definitely change yours as well. All you need is a little belief in yourself and I definitely believe in you, so let's get into it. What does Lady Gaga, Stephen Colbert, and Benedict Cumberbatch all have in common? Well, they all like to marry people. And when I say marry people, I mean not actually get married, but the one doing the marrying. They all have become ordained ministers and you can too. Ordained ministers perform weddings, baptisms, even funerals, and provide spiritual and legal guidance to their local communities. I used to be a wedding DJ, and one thing that I saw all the time was just these officiants who were doing the actual wedding, showing up literally minutes before the wedding started. They went through their little 20, 25 minute spiel, they signed the marriage license when they were done, and then they were gone didn't even stay for the reception. And then there were times where I was able to actually catch up with some of them and see what they were doing the rest of the day. And nine times out of 10, they had about two or three other weddings they needed to go do, all getting paid around 300 bucks each. And here is the best part about this. This is pretty much an evergreen niche because just around the world in general, there are over 40 million weddings being performed every single year. So in order to become a wedding officiant, you do need to become ordained in your particular state or country, depending on where you are. If you are in the United States, states it is pretty easy all you have to do is just go online to a website called get ordained click on a particular state you happen to be in and then figure out what process you have to follow to become a minister on the money meter i'm going to give this one a seven out of ten all right so what if i told you that the best way to make money meaning making money in your pajamas is just as easy as creating your own product or something that you can sell over and over again well because we live in the digital age one of the best ways to do that is to create a digital product but not just any digital product there's a a ton of ideas out there the ones i'm specifically talking about would be cover letters and resume templates so before we get into it let me show you how i know that this is a very viable business model for you to copy if you watch this channel you probably also know about her right here her name is jasmine mccall and she makes over a hundred thousand dollars every single month just selling her own personal cover letter and resume templates i talk about more in-depth stuff within my newsletter called your extra paycheck so be sure to check that out but in this channel i've had over 1300 subscribers just in the last month talking about side hustles and remote jobs so definitely there are a ton of people who are interested in this stuff you just have to find a way to sell it so even though i will give this one a 7 out of 10 on the money meter the best way to promote this kind of thing is our next side hustle now on the money meter i give this one a solid 10 out of 10 because it is just mind-blowing and amazing when you do it right there is something that not a lot of people know or even realize and that is if you were to find a way to make a hundred dollars off of a thousand people, you could make a six figure income. So obviously the question is, how do you get in front of a thousand people, right? Well, because of the internet, it is super easy and social media is the ticket for that. In fact, this next side hustle that we're about to talk about gets 2.5 billion active users every single month. And that platform is YouTube. For reference, 2.5 billion, that's billion with a B, people on this planet is more than 30% of the total earth population. And they're all sitting there watching YouTube, which is really crazy to me. So if all you needed was a thousand people to make a hundred bucks off of, you would only need 0 0.000004 of those eyeballs to be looking at your particular product and make some money from it. To get started, all you really need to do is choose a niche, do some competitor research, and then get out there and just start making videos. The best way to make money with this is to create your own products, such as creating cover letters and resume templates that we talked about earlier or you can also dabble in affiliate marketing where you're able to pretty much promote other people's products for a nice passive income. The next side hustle just makes too much sense because when you think about your bills, most of your bills are recurring bills, meaning that you have to pay for them every single month, no matter what. But what if I told you that there was a way to create an income that pays you every single month? Well, you can do that with what's called a membership. Now, a membership can really be a lot of things. So for example, a membership could be a website where you provide a particular service or product every single month or you could do something as simple as washing people's cars and then charging people on like a retainer where you would return every single week to wash their cars the idea here is to create that recurring revenue over and over again because you're going to always be able to get paid now here's where the rubber meets the road and the real cool part about getting some type of recurring income so a cool trick to really get this right is to sit down and figure out every single bill that you have throughout the month and then you start building up that recurring memory 
membership model and you don't stop until you have made more than what you're paying out every single month. It's easier than you think, but it's a great way to actually building some good wealth. So on the money meter, an eight out of 10. All right, so with this next side hustle, if you have like a basement or an extra room in your home or anything, then you're gonna wanna pay attention to this. A big problem that most people have when it comes to going to the gym is just that, actually going to the gym. Now, sometimes people will try to hack this where they do a home gym, but the problem there is that you need to be disciplined enough to remove yourself from your office, remove yourself from family and other types of housework and actually do your workouts. So a way that you could solve that problem is by creating either in your basement or an extra room, your own gym and then charge people a membership for it. You end up solving both problems because people within your area who don't feel like, you know, maybe having to jump in the car and going to the gym could literally just walk over to your house and work out. But then it is also removed from their home so that they can concentrate on getting a good workout in. So take some spare space within your home and get some equipment like a cardio machine, weights, yoga mats, or even resistance bands. Create a welcome atmosphere. And then if you're really feeling froggish about this, start actually doing some classes on a particular thing that you like to do, just something nice and organized so that people can get a regular workout routine. So this guy right here, Chad Paul, actually took a gym up to $100,000 per month and it all started right there within his home. On a money meter, six out of 10. All right, so here is another unbelievably and useful side hustle that you're gonna wish I would have told you sooner. All right, so let me ask you this. Have you noticed the number of podcasts that have been popping up on YouTube lately? I mean, honestly, it's gotten to the point where like everybody has one. I'm just like, come on guys. But that doesn't mean that it's oversaturated. And let me tell you why. So I like to call this the the TikTok effect, right? Because of TikTok, people's attention spans have gotten like this big, okay, like insanely small. So because of that, it has created a bit of a gap in the market for people who want the short form content, but then there are a growing number of people who want the long form content. And when I say long form, I mean really long form content. I mean, if you don't believe me, just look at some of the lengths of these podcasts. It's not always just an hour. There's like three hour podcasts and five hour podcasts. I mean, who really sits down for that amount of time to watch a podcast? But the thing is, they're getting hundreds of thousands and sometimes millions of views. So because of this, it is now better than ever to become a podcaster. But the caveat there is that you do need to become a video podcaster. So right now, and you'll notice this with any social media network, especially when they're trying to push something. I mean, YouTube did this recently with shorts, but it gets to the point to where when they want something to do well, they give it a few extra bonus points for creating it, which means you're gonna get more views than you probably would have if you didn't do it. But here's the cool thing about starting a podcast. You actually don't need a ton of stuff. All you really need is a very good idea, which is super important. Make sure that you have a good idea, a cheap microphone that you can get off of Amazon for probably less than a hundred bucks, and your phone for the video. You can either interview people or you can do solo podcasts where you're actually talking on your own. Now, distribution, as in getting people to listen to the podcast, as well as making money from the podcast can sometimes prove a little difficult, but because of YouTube and what they're doing, they are making this process a whole lot easier. However, once you do kind of figure out the whole sponsorships for podcasts and you can also make money with your own products and affiliate marketing, really the whole world kind of opens up to the amount of money that you can make with a podcast. In fact, I know some sponsorships alone that are paying certain podcasts over $30,000 per month just to be mentioned in these podcasts. So definitely the potential is there. You just got to get out there and start on the money meter an eight out of 10. Now this next side hustle is, it's strange to me because no one else is really talking about it, but I'm about to. And it's called the middleman method of freelancing. I mean, freelancing is already a great way to retake control of your own schedule and being able to work what you on what you want when you want. But the whole trick to freelancing is being able to find consistent work all the time so that you can make a decent amount of money. So let me give you an example. This guy right here, Thomas, is making more money than he knows what to do with with his new freelance business. In fact, he talks about it on his channel pretty regularly. Now, what he does is amazing, all right? He does social media management. Now, you might think that's not very exciting, but 
there's a method to the madness. Here's the thing. He doesn't do the social media management himself. He employs a method that we talked about briefly a second ago, the middleman method. So what he does is, is pretty awesome. He goes out and he finds jobs and then he gets paid a certain amount for that job and then turns around, takes that money and hires someone else to do it for him a lot cheaper. And at that point, all he needs to do is just pocket the difference. But the kicker here is how much money he earns. He earns upwards of $10,000 per month just by doing this. And he doesn't post any other social media content himself. And trust me, you'll find this out if you ever watch any of his videos, but Thomas is like one of the chillest dudes I've ever seen. But it's up to you just to get started. So on the money meter, seven out of 10. You see, the thing is making money with side hustles, it's not going to always be easy. But with the right equipment, you can make a ton of money. And my favorite type of equipment that you can use is your phone, your mobile device. And in this video right here, I show you four pretty outstanding side hustles that you can do only using your phone. So be sure to go and check that out. I believe in you and it's about time that you believed in yourself. Take care.